Hey guys, Ben Cool Merlin Goon here to back with another reaction video. Today we are gonna react to Smash Bracket Kirby I mean Jigglypuff versus Kirby. So yeah, this is basically like Death Battle but with Smash characters. And I wanted to try something new because I didn't want to get anything interesting to Death Battle, so yeah. So we're gonna watch this. And I'm, and there's gonna, and there's gonna be a link to the video down below, so you can watch this, and you could come back here and watch me reacting to this video. So yeah, I'm gonna put the link down in the description below. So yeah, let's get into it. What would happen if two of the cutest puffballs in gaming yeah. went toe to toe in a battle Wait. to determine who would come out on top? I'm Ink, and this is Smash Bracket, a show dedicated to solving that exact question. If each playable character from the Super Smash Bros. Oh, was entered into a giant fighting tournament using them at the peak of their strength, who would be victorious? The rules for this series are on screen now, with a link for a further break. Okay, I need to see the rules. Okay. Down in the description. With all that in place, let's take a look at today's match between Jigglypuff and Kirby to see who I'm going with Kirby because for one he could easily destroy Jigglypuff. But I don't know if they're gonna nerf Ker Kirby. In the world of Pokemon, when I, I, a child turns ten years old, they have a chance to obtain their trainer's license and get a Pokemon all of their own. Yay. When I was a kid I used to dream about all the possibilities of different Pokemon I could get. A fearsome Charizard, an unbeatable Mewtwo, and there were even a few years where Farfetch was my dream Pokemon. Farfetch? For some reason that I could wow. I tried. But when I sat down and played Super Smash Bros. 64 for the very first time, I'm gonna try not to get copyright game or of the sassiest Pokemon in the franchise. Jigglypuff has been a fan favorite in the world of Pokemon for decades. Wait, seriously? So Smash Okay. So people hate playing Jigglypuff with Smash, but she's a fan favorite. Wow. I'm just speechless. Her role in the anime. And although she stands at only 20 inches tall, Jigglypuff is bursting with enough sass wow. to more than compensate for her height. She loves attention, <laughs> sings everywhere she goes, is prone to overdramatic fits of rage when people fail to appreciate her, and gets oh. on the nerves of all the uh, people. Sorry, Emma. Yet, for some reason, they My chose friend. to title her the Balloon Pokemon, rather than Balloon. the drama student Pokemon. The Pokemon franchise is unique in the way that it was created. The anime, manga, and video games were all made to proceed and next they might have like a either oh never mind <laughs> I, I i was gonna say something stupid so while the canon of these different mediums have gradually departed from one another we've chosen to look at all three of them together for the purposes of smash bracket if we were to only use the games anime or manga by the so are they gonna use all of them strange interpretations of the characters with some really bizarre power she's gonna use all the versions of jigglypuff representative of what we actually see when looking at the franchise as a whole on a similar note because Smash Bracket is interested in seeing what each character is capable of at their maximum strength, Pokemon will be treated as trainer owned and optimized. Oh. They'll be fully leveled with access to their entire move pool. Oh. I don't. I'm still going for Kirby because he has like a lot of abilities. <laughs> the maximum potential and strength of Pokemon, and it's so integral to the series that we felt as though not allowing access to trainers would be denying a key. Wait, trainers? Many of the Pokemon in Smash actually come out of Pokeballs when they enter the stage, implying a pre-existing relationship between Pokemon and their trainers rather than so, Pokemon. Jigglypuff's gonna have a trainer. Of a trainer like this that Jigglypuff's true potential comes out. She's physically strong enough to break Can the wait, I need to read this. Can this weapon then? <laughs> David 504. I don't even know who was that guy. Uh Us. Fast enough to traumatize both of us and leave a blast of water in her wake. She's also quick enough to do this. Wait, what even just happened there? All right, so I know. she sneaks up behind Pikachu, okay. gives him a Muay Thai round kick to the what face, the sends him flying to the side, and then gets back to Misty's side before anyone can tell what she was doing, including Pikachu. <laughs> the face. Okay. This is All weird. Right. <laughs> yeah. Was she gonna slip here? <laughs> is where she narrowly dodges a bolt of natural lightning. It's important to note that she doesn't actually move in tandem with the lightning here, and it's still much faster than her in the scene. But by measuring Jigglypuff's movement against the amount of time that I'm still going for Kirby, screen, we can calculate her speed at nearly 3,000 miles per hour here. 
Oh. Okay. Oh. Yes, that crap. Hmm. <laughs> Super Saiyan Goku. So. Quick Claw. Quick Claw. The Quick Claw. Including speed dioxys and regieleki. Regieleki. This thing. Regieleki. What? The Pokemon world. The Pokemon world has like weird names. Literally, the weirdest names of all names. I just. It just doesn't make any sense. Verdi. Oh. Okay. Show me more. Show me. Wait. Q char. Oh, chance of poke. So. Chance of being. Wait. I need to read this. They act like it. Yeah, they do. Okay. I've been there, buddy. Ow. So you're telling me... This... Okay. I mean... Brain kiss? Okay. Okay, I should probably start. Yep, I should probably start. Oh god. Outside of just confusion though, Jigglypuff has a few other ways to attack enemies with their own strength. Jigglypuff Fred back at gotcha. you. Yeah. If she were to use mimic or Jigglypuff could temporarily borrow an attack from an enemy to use on her own. Disable on the other hand from the enemy altogether. Jigglypuff has access to a surprising range of elemental attacks. I swear, Kirby's gonna lose. I just get that feeling. I, I don't know if they're gonna nerf Kirby. That's why I'm scared. Okay, voice attacks. Okay, okay, okay. Wait, she can mimic a talking pe- Wow. I didn't know she could mimic Pikachu. Oh, she did. So, you know, yeah, I <laughs> heard. Wait. Mimicking talk. Okay. Wow. Yeah. But I didn't know she could. Wait, wait. Protect, cold, and rest. Opens up, snores, and. Okay, I feel like I'm gonna lose. Sleep talk. Oh yeah, the Super Smash Bros. Uh, weird crap. Uh, weird crap. I feel like this is basically the version of Death Battle, but if it ha if it was Smash Bros. Okay. 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 Wait. Yeah, but, but also only be oh I didn't have enough time to read this. Okay, I didn't have enough time to read that. Jigs? Okay. I'm scared. Excuse me. Kirby. Oh, wait, I gotta do this. Edit more. Okay. Alright. Yeah. They are. 
also be the ones to make your life the most miserable. These adorable terrors travel the stars. Yes. How? I don't know. Although English translations do tend to refer to Kirby as the male, if Kirby had his way, each day would be filled with sleeping and eating before his battle is on intergalactic threat. Jesus, how does the cutest enemies become so deadly? That's that's what I'm confused. <laughs> yes, never change, never. <laughs> Today, <laughs> DC Super Goes, <laughs> that's, I don't know. Jeez. Infinite? Okay, never mind, Kirby's gonna win. Kirby's gonna win. Go on. Kirby needs to win this. I swear, if he doesn't. True. I swear, they're not gonna cover Kirby's all of his analysis. Okay, please. I want Kirby to win so bad. So here's the standard that they'll have to meet in order for us to use them. I'm gonna put it on screen right now. Wait, it's time for wait, I need to read this. Okay. I read all I I read Rules. Oh god, I'm sorry. So we're looking at Kirby's mini games through his lens. Wait, so we're Okay. We can narrow down some solid contenders for Kirby's maximum strength. That doesn't make any sense. Why are we going to cover... We need to talk about size. Because contrary to what I've been telling people my entire life, it really does matter. Size? What the fuck? Kirby's... Jigglypuff's taller than Kirby. He's a baby. No, really. He's a big baby. <laughs> Ow. The fuck? Jeez. Sure. Oh yeah, yeah. I'm sorry. Jesus is long. Okay. Pop star. Pop star. Okay. Wait, here's the way I need to read this. All of it. Oh. Yes. What? It's both. It's all of them. It's basically all of them. I mean, what the hell are all those Earths? Wait. I didn't see it. Ugh. Wait, uh, I'm gonna go back. Wait. Okay, yeah, I, I, I can't. Um, I want to see it after. I'm a fucker. Sorry, cursing. YouTube, please don't monetize me. Uh, 
Wow. Impressive. Best? The Warp Star. Of course. Dang. Jeez, so this cute, adorable, but yet deadly Nintendo character can be gods. Ow. Oh, yeah, okay, they're gonna include the mini games. I forgot. Okay, um. Boom, boom, boom. The wall with. Ah. Like, oh. Besizing the planets in this series is so pivotal for the strength of its characters, but the series is so inconsistent. What is he doing? So many different power levels that you can what is he doing? Where is he going? Where is he going? If Hagen decides literally and comparing Kirby's height to the meteor, this puts Kirby's height in at nearly 15 light years tall. Dick. I just. <laughs> That's just hilarious. Damn it. <laughs> they got the Suicide Squad reference. Yeah, yeah. Oh, God. Wow. I can't. Oh, get out of my camera. Power ups, yes, please. So that's what he's gonna do in this battle because I don't know, I'm just confused. <laughs> Wait, is it was that from the Ben Ten versus Green Lantern? Wait, I need. Wait, I need. I need to. Hey. Wait. <laughs> hey, they referenced. Hey, they referenced the battle. Well, kind of. Oh God. Oh yeah, cook Kirby. Jesus, Kirby, you kill. You cook cute things, and you make them to meals. Yeah. Uh, yes. But how would they taste? Do they have blood? Or, uh, I'm, I'm, I'm not gonna go any further. That. Okay, I'm still going for Kirby. He might take this. Yes. This Jigglypuff loss. Yes. 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 <laughs> Kate. Wait, what? Joker versus... Wait, Joker versus Cloud. Okay, they're doing future fights. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm excited. Okay. Okay. Now I'm now I'm wondering who would win because there's I we just saw me okay. I I'm, I'm gonna go for Kirby still, but I swear if G Jigglypuff beats Kirby. I, I, I'm, I, I, there, Kirby wins. I'm sorry. It's over for Jigglypuff. But, I'm just gonna get to the fight. It's time for the fight. Let's go. Okay. No. 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 Go. 
Sorry, Sonic. I feel bad for you, though. Oh, Jiggles. Oh, yeah, we are. We got him, Jiggles. Oh, Jiggles. Kirby, 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 it's like, move out of the way, it's my time to shine. That was hilarious. Kirby. Oh, wait, did it? I wasn't to play it. Who the fuck do you think you're on? Go. Kirby, you know, Kirby. The, s the soundtrack. Holy shit. I'm sorry for cursing. <laughs> Sonic! Sonic! <laughs> Sonic just was like, ah, screw this, I'm out. You know, help. Wait, is Kirby- Oh, God, Kirby, no! Kirby, don't you dare lose! Oh, shit. Kirby, please. Kirby, I s No! They are not gonna make Kirby lose. They are not gonna make Kirby lose the goddamn fight. This is just gonna be bullshit. Use the god super <laughs> No. Kirby. If you lose, Kirby, don't you dare lose. Use the goddamn super. Use the no! Yes! No! <gasps> yes! Cook up the goddamn dinner! I know that didn't make any sense. Wait, what? Yes. Don't you dare. <gasps> God damn it, it has to cut to an ad. Kirby. Don't you dare lose the fight, my boy. Please. Win. Please. Oh, shit! <gasps> Kirby! Yes! And there you yes! Go. Now, on paper, this seems like an incredibly one-sided stomp of a match. And if someone were to only look at the stat sheet for each character, then that would be a totally fair assumption to make. Even if Jiggly yes! had a surprising advantage of combat speed before even calculating in stat boosting moves, I thought they were gonna nerf Kirby! I thought they were gonna nerf Kirby! Thank you, Smash Bracket! I'm sorry. Yes, Kirby won! But we are gonna get an alternate ending! So, yeah. If you took every single Oh god, Kirby won. Kir Kirby won the goddamn fight. Yes. Wait, so so did Kirby technically kill Jigglypuff? Man, Kirby, that's dark. Even for you. But then again. What? The soundtrack, though, it was it was lit. <laughs> Cuteness always wins the battle. I feel like the next battle has to be. She, I. Okay. Oh yeah, the kiss. 
Kirby doesn't have meaningful enough resistance to poison damage in order to withstand Toxic's effects. Yay, Kirby won. Yes, my boy won. My boy, wait, I need to get my boy. I need to get my boy. My boy won. My boy won the battle. Yes, Kirby, you won the goddamn battle. Sorry for cursing. But my boy won. It was technically everyone else's boy, but I. Kirby won. Oh, thank God. Oh, God. Oh, God. True. Oh, did all Kirby wanted to do was have a dance competition? That's all. Jigglypuff, you, you don't have to be a jerk. You wanted to have a dance competition gets you. You know what? Yes! Okay, that sounds like death battle. Wait, wait. wait. Okay, and Sephiroth. I predicted it. Oh shit. Sorry for cursing. Gimme. But Kirby won the battle. Kirby won the battle royale. Thank you. Thank you. Oh god. So yeah. That was awkward. The video probably might get, be taken down. So yeah, but I, I don't care. Kirby won. My boy won. My boy won. My boy won. So yeah. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed this. I will probably do this too. It's a series two. Smash Bracket. Hopefully, because I won't. I hopefully YouTube won't screw me up. So yeah, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Well, next next video, it's gonna be a concept or reaction. So yeah, bye.